Hi guys. Hi guys. Welcome back. Hope you're all doing well. As you know, we haven't been able to post many videos in the past few months due to the restrictions because of COVID. But now here in New South Wales, Australia, the government has eased the restrictions and we are now permitted to travel within the state. So today we are here in the city of Bathurst. So that's right guys. We are here for a day trip to Bathurst. Bathurst is one of the oldest inland settlement in Australia. It took off really well when people started coming here and settling down after the discovery of gold in the early 1850s. Yes, the city has a lot of culture and history associated with it and today we are hoping to discover a part of it. So let's continue. Bathurst has attractions that can be completed in a day trip. So we decided to leave early in the morning. The city is famous for its racing tracks, museums, walking trails and parks. However, if you want to soak in the country vibe, it is definitely a destination to spend a pleasant weekend. Bathurst is a three-hour drive towards the west of Sydney. We have to cross the Blue Mountains to reach here. So that's how we decided to make it our first stop. Hey guys, uh, we are at Blue Mountains. It is extremely cold, oh, but the view is so so beautiful. How is it? Mm. Oh God, my hands are freezing and I can't feel it. <laughs> we decided to have breakfast over there. Mm, <laughs> bread will fly. <laughs> We stopped at some random location on our way and look at the fog. Bathurst was just as we expected. Quiet roads, pleasant weather and a lot of colourful buildings. Our first stop for the day was Mount Panorama Racing Circuit. This is where the internationally famous Bathurst 1000 car race is held every October. But it was exciting to know that this racing track is open for public on all other months and so we decided to give it a try. We cannot drive recklessly and need to ensure that we maintain a speed of 60 km per hour but hell it was so cool. These are the galleries and these are possibly where the car services are done during the race. And on the opposite side, we have the another set of seats which says it's the grandstand. National Motor Racing Museum, which is right next to the racing track. It would probably have around 100 racing cars and motorbikes from all eras that have made their mark not only on Mount Panorama, but across Australia. Our next stop was the Australian Fossil and Mineral Museum. Just so you guys know, the city is very small and you can reach all these places in very short duration. Social distancing was given importance everywhere we went and the crowd was responsible enough to follow it. I never knew minerals, oxides or sulphides for that matter looked so beautiful until I saw the huge display here.
We stopped at this roadside restaurant to quickly have our lunch and then checked into the rail museum. All these attractions have a small section for cute gifts and mementos. So don't forget to grab yourself a souvenir on your way back. As you walk in you will see the history of the development of rail network in Bathurst. and also displays of vintage vessels clothes and other accessories used during those times one thing that stands out here is the model railway the size of a tennis court the scale model of the main west railway during the 1950s and 1960s displays the tarana to bathurs line and is complete with operating toy trains This is probably where you would have seen us the most excited. Mekiti Park is one of the centrally located park in Bathurst. An interesting fact is this area actually housed a court and jail initially. Let's go now. Okay. <laughs> What are you trying to do? It's a big tree, isn't it? That's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you liked our video, and if you do, please hit the like button and also do share it with your friends and families. Also, if you've not subscribed to our channel, don't forget to subscribe it and hit the bell notification icon to receive all the notifications whenever we upload a video. So till then, travel bucks.